One is, um, if I want to invest, I must have a choice where I want to invest. I should not be forced to invest in this venture or this other venture. Uh, and if you're telling me that it is an investment, then you must tell me what kind of interest I'm going to get out of it so that I can make up my mind whether I want to take my money to the financial market or I want to invest my money, put my money as a deposit in the bank to earn an interest. Uh, but there must be a choice. There must be consultations. Kenyans have not been properly consulted before these measures are, are being introduced. And they're now being introduced and they're being told, irrespective of what you say, these things are going to pass. In other words, the kind of consultation they're talking about is, is, is useless. It's fruitless. Um, the second question you asked is... Uh, Yes, yeah, by partisan talks, um, we have received a progress report from our team, and they are saying that uh, they have made some progress. Uh, they are going to continue uh, next week. There are issues which are very critical, which we gave a deadline of 30 days. That those within 30 days, you must have a solution. This includes the cost of living. The cost of essential commodities like unga, oil, cooking oil, the price of electricity, school fees, and so on. Secondly, the issue of server, the forensic audit of the server, there must be a, a, a solution to it within these remaining days. Um, and then the other one is a, a guarantee and assurance that there will be no interference with all Azimio affiliated political parties. Uh, you said that, for example, they must not continue to interfere with the Jubilee political party. Uh, they must give us an undertaking that they will not interfere, for example, the Jubilee's uh, general as assembly or uh, convention which is scheduled to take place on, t on, on Monday next week, the 22nd. These are some of the issues that we have, we, 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 we have, we have raised.